All right, everybody's here. We are so pumped to be coming at you guys this morning with a live full body kettlebell workout. Option to grab a single dumbbell. We're just going to have you covered there. I'm Lindsay Bomber and wish me love. And we are so pumped to be with you guys live today. We got the awesome Rachel. Hi. She's going to be showing you how you can do this entire kettlebell workout with a single dumbbell. So we're pumped. We're going to let people jump on and say good morning to you guys. We're super pumped today. We have Judy with us for her first time live ever. Welcome, Judy. We got Patty coming at us live. Nice. Rachel's here and she's excited. We have Teresa, also her first live, and she loves our workout. You're feeling stronger. We love to hear that, Teresa. Nice work. You're trying to heal your diastasis recti. And our videos have helped so much. We're so happy to hear that. Thank you so much. Yes, that's like our most popular video. And we're actually coming out with the DR Challenge. It is coming out, a full 28-day workout plan. We love our free workout plans. Speaking of free workout plans, we just dropped a new one. If you're on our email list, nourishmovelove.com backslash subscribe. We just dropped a new two-week workout challenge in your inbox for February. We are super pumped about it. We are kicking it off as a community on Monday. So we'll be joining you guys, um, dropping in Monday, this Monday, to, I don't know, no one knows what day it is. We're all looking at each other like, what day is it? Today's Groundhog's Day, it's 2-2. Two, 2-6 two. Two, is there Monday. So we'll be kicking that off on Monday, 2-6. If you still wanna get it, no problem, jump on our email list. We'll land in your inbox on Sunday morning with your seven-day workout plan for next week. And the meal plan. And a meal plan, that's meal plan. We teamed up with our friends, the real food dietitians who we love. So we have a dietitian approved two week free meal plan. Like, does it get any better than that? Free two week workout challenge and two week meal plan. Make sure you get on our email list and make sure you hit subscribe to our YouTube channel, you guys. So you're always notified when we drop a new workout. We will be dropping new workouts during this challenge. All right. We are so pumped to sweat with you guys today. Nice work. I think we got people joining on. Awesome. Emily, you did our 40 minute pyramid yesterday. Oof. Good luck to you today. Good luck, my friend, Emily. Good luck. We're so pumped to have you guys with us on Instagram. Good morning, Kamel. Good morning, Jennifer. Awesome. Okay, you guys, we are pumped, pumped, pumped. Let's talk about the workout today. It is a 30-minute full-body kettlebell workout. Thanks to Brianna, who commented that she wanted more kettlebell workouts in one of our last live workouts. So, Brianna, this workout is for you, okay? If you guys want to give us your two cents, we love to connect with you. That's why we love doing these live workouts. You can always drop a comment of what workout you'd like to see in our next live or in our next program. You can also super chat or super thanks. We have those turned on. If you want to show your appreciation for these free live workouts, you can do that by super chatting us or super thanksing us. Speaking of super thanks, we want to give a huge shout out to Jill, who has been working out with us for over a year. She just dropped a super thanks on our channel yesterday. She's been working out with us for one year, and she is sharing us with all of her friends. So thank you for sharing with friends. We love it. Now let's sweat, Rich. Let's go. Woo! Let's do this, team. We're going to start with a nice warm-up. Like I said, I have kettlebells. I actually have an assortment anywhere from 20 pounds to 35 pounds. I'm going to be challenging myself, but also modifying I am. 13, 14 weeks post knee surgery, so I'm gonna have to modify some of the lower body movements, okay? Rachel's got dumbbells, she's gonna show you how you can do this entire workout with a single dumbbell. Use what you have, let's get this party started. I wanna mention, if you have an activity tracker on, I like to, I have the Garmin, I love it, I can link it below. Um, I flip it so the, the watch faces me, so I don't scratch my watch face during kettlebell movements. We're gonna be cleaning the weight up to here, okay? So I always flip it so it's facing this way so I don't scratch my watch face. So, little pro tip, pro tip, pro tips, pro tips. Okay, let's get this party started. Warm up, feet are stacked underneath my hips. Let's go, big inhale, reach your legs and tall. Exhale, baby, back bend. Now I should take it down, slap out those weights. Woo! If you did today's this, the push workout this week, this feels sore, good, right? Oh, little tight and sore, feel that. Nice, we're gonna go one hip hinge, one squat. So it looks like this. Give me a hip hinge, stand tall, give me a squat. Stand tall, give me a hip hinge, stand tall, give me a squat. Nice, so I'm pushing my hips back, dropping my hips down. My range of motion is gonna be a little bit modified on the squat front, okay? So I'm going not as deep as Rachel. I'm just not clear to do that yet, especially with weight. Still recovering on the knee front, but I'm gonna do my best today. I'm gonna do what I'm capable of, and that's what we ask of you. You guys do what you are capable of. Nice, two more, two more, squat, stand, hinge. One more, one more, squat, stand, and hinge. Nice, you're gonna pretend like you have a weight, you're gonna clean it up, so you're gonna tap the ground, clean it up to the shoulder, tap the ground, clean. Just filling in some power. I want you to think about driving through your heels to stand you tall. Nice, getting that weight up to your shoulder. Boom, it's a big powerful movement. I forgot to mention, today's workout, new format. New, brand new, Ooh. we're testing something new. New format, I'm pumped up, it's gonna be fun. 
one, go three, two, one more. Nice, let's take it to the back of our mat. We're gonna walk up to a high plank. Nice hinge. Walk out, find yourself in a high plank position. Hold it here. Step right foot upside, right hand, easy twist. Put it down, left foot upside, left hand, easy twist. Nice, put it down, walk it back in. Hands to the back, big reach overhead. Let's do it again. Hinge, walk out, find that high plank, hold here. Right foot upside, right hand, easy twist. Nice, left foot upside, left hand, easy twist. Nice, and walk it back in. I'm also mad able to jump right now, which is why I've been loving kettlebell training, because it is a great way to build strength and power. Definitely gonna raise your heart rate with zero jumping today, if you choose. Nice, we're gonna do that one more time, guys. One more time, walk it out, hold that high plank. Let's hold this right foot outside, right hand, easy twist, hold it here. Give me some shoulder swings to the back, for three, two, one, nice work, set it down, switch it out, left foot outside, left hand, shoulder sweeps for three, two, one, nice work, here we go, right here, we're going to go, one push up, one reach back, down dog, so reaching out to the hand, opposite calf, chin, high plank, push up, reach back, opposite calf, opposite chin, nice, push up, you can always take this up to the baseline, you can always drop to the knees and you need the push up from the knees, pop to the toes, with a tap back, nice, right here, push up, Tap back, one more, one more, let's go, push up. Tap back, nice, go ahead, drop to the knees. Give me a couple cat cows, let's just drop the belly, and then reverse it, nice. Drop the belly, and reverse it, spine toward the side. Come to find a nice neutral spine. This is where we're gonna wanna be today, for deadlifts, for swings, okay? Tuck those toes under, hold the bear crawl, hold the bear crawl, knees hover for three, two, one, let's go. Step back to plank, slow work, be step in, step the right foot, the left foot, stand up, take it down, step back, switch that knee foot, go left, right, stand up, take it down, nice work, team, go right, left, up, one more, one more, this is it, stand it up, nice and tall, right here, grab your weight if you have it, a light weight to start with, light weight to start with, All right, two more moves for the warm up, take the weight, kettlebell right here to my chest, I'm at 20 pound, my lightest kettlebell, you're going to give me a hip hinge, I'll rotate and a push. Woo! That's jumping back to center. Stand up. Here we go. Hands rotate other direction. Push the weight away from the body. Bring it back in. Center. Stand. Nice little spine warm up. Woo! Yes. Hello, core. Hinge. Rotate. Push. In. Center. Stand. One more each way. Hinge. Rotate. Push. Center. Nice. Stand. Hinge. Rotate. Push, center, hinge. Now we're just gonna swing it out. Couple swings. It's my lighter weight, okay? I'm really thinking about not overextending at the top. We're gonna do a lot of swings today. Some standard stance, some B stance, okay? Think about driving through my heels. to stand me tall. I'm just gonna show you from the side. We're just gonna keep swinging. Hinge, stand tall. I'm not here, okay? I'm not squatting, okay? Hinge, drive. Hinge, drive. Hinge for three. Nice. Two. And one more range. I'm warm. Okay, before we jump in to get this party started, we've got to show you because we promise you guys get to pick the last minute move. There's a poll at the top of our YouTube feed here in the chat. You get a vote. For one minute, we are going to finish this workout either with a down dog plank drag. Rachel's going to show you that here. Yeah. I'm going to show you a B stance burpee, basically a burpee with a kettlebell pickup. So you're going to keep one lead foot one stagger, so it's like a stagger stance burpee. Okay, I'm gonna show you option A, Rachel shows you option B, here we go. Burpee, B stance, pick up, set down. Okay, Rachel's got a down dog plank drag. What would you like to do for one minute at the end of today's workout? Tell us by voting in the poll in the chat. You guys get a pick, that's why we love live workouts, they're fun, we get to interact with you. Grab some water and get ready to party, team. All right, good morning, Laura. Welcome, Sarah. You're ready to work hard. Nice. You voted for burpees then, yes? Okay, good. All right. Can you tell us what I want? I like the B stance burpee. I want the B stance burpee. Team B stance burpee. What team are you for? I like the plank. I like the plank pull. Oh, Rachel and team down dog plank. Which team are you on? Vote. Where are we at, Megan? What's our, what are we at? Down dog plank is winning. Oh. By what percent? Um, we are at 
63. 63%. Come on, Team Berkey, get in. So we're going to wait until the end of the workout? We're going to wait until the end. You have the whole time to vote. I got this whole workout to vote. Some people are like, let me see how, how I feel. Yeah, let's <laughs> see how your shoulders are versus okay. your legs. Right? Let's All right, see. we are warming up. We're ready to party. Your first circuit is legs. We go legs, arms, legs, arms. You got three moves for each circuit. The first two moves are 30 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Your final move is a one minute move. So we go 30, 10, 30, 10, one minute. You rest for 30 seconds. You repeat it. Do it. Yeah, let's do it. New format. We'd love to hear what you think. Drop us in the comments. What do you think of the new format? Let's go legs. Legs. I'm going to take my baby weight from my squats because I got to hurt me. I'm going to go a little bit heavier. First move, set down, pick up squats. My favorite way to start a kettlebell workout. If you've done my kettlebell workouts right here. I'm going to go one hand on. So I'm going to pick it up. I'm going to set it down, release it. So it's one weighted squat, one air squat. One weighted squat, one air squat. You're gonna do that for 30 seconds and then you're gonna go right into racking the weight just on the right side of the body, right here. We're just gonna squat it out. Just on the right side and on even squat, okay? That's your first two moves. I'll tell you what your one minute move is once we get there, yes? Let's go. Go team, go. Alternating, set down, pick up squat, your alternating hand, pick up the weight with your right hand. In three, two, let's go, let's go 30 seconds, pick it up. Set it down, stand up one body weight, one pickup. Also, I'm really loving kettlebell workouts right now because it meets me where I'm at with my range of motion. So you'll notice Rachel has to go deeper into her squat with the dumbbell. And if you're struggling with that, you can always place your dumbbell right now on a book, on a yoga block, on a small bench, okay? That you can straddle. Nice work, 30 seconds here, of which you have five left on even squat. Hold that weight in the right hand in three, two, one, I'm gonna go to my lighter weight. You got 10 seconds to rest. Rack it, if you're with me, you rack right here. Keep it tight, squat it out in three, two. Let's go, let's go, down and up again. I'm going for the shallow squat because my knee, Rachel's gonna give you a little bit more depth. Squat it out for 30 seconds. Then we rest for another 10. And then we go one minute, alternating cleans. Alternating cleans, one of my favorite moves. Woo, let's go team. Come on, turning one is legs, all about the legs. You're here for 10 more seconds, 10 more seconds, load it up, come on. You got this, final five, four, three, two, and one. Weights are down, rest, alternating cleans, okay? Hinge, pull to the right shoulder, drop to the left shoulder. Power comes from the hips, it's one minute of work, one minute of work, are you ready, Rich? Let's go. Cleans, I'm thinking, heels pop, hips drive, weight to shoulder, in three, Two, let's go. Clean on the right, set it down, switch. Clean on the left, set it down, switch. This is your minute of work. You decide your pace, you decide your weight. I want you to keep moving for the entire 60 seconds. So you tell me what that's gonna look like for you today. Okay, Woo. nice work team. It's a one minute move. It's gonna raise your heart rate and build some strength. Clean, Rachel, what do you think about them? I love them. Yes, I feel like I've gotten so used to just going straight into a snatch, but it's kind of nice to break down the movement a little bit. Right? Like nail this first part. It also allows me to go a little heavier here. I will say the reason I love kettlebell training, I think kettlebells are the first workouts that taught me I'm stronger than I think I am. Because mm -hmm. I only had a 25 pound weight. So I was like, well, I guess I gotta do a shoulder press with 25 pounds. <laughs> Woo! 10 seconds. And I realized I was stronger than I thought I was. Yes, you are too. Five, four. Three, two, and one. Set it down. Rest for 30 seconds. How do we feel? Whew. I like it. Let's we go. repeat it. Okay, set down, pick up squats. 30 seconds on, 10 seconds out. Loaded squat. On the left, 30 seconds. Another minute of cleans. Close up, so get one. Whew. 10 seconds, guys. 10 seconds, set down, pick up squats. Straddle that weight. Pick up the weight with your left hand. In three, two, let's go. Pick it up, set it down. Nice, alternate, pick up right, set down. Nice, nice, go heavy here. You're only getting half the amount of weighted squats in, so go heavy, yes? But you virtually get your squats for one minute. <laughs> so it keeps going though. So it adds up, right? Nice work. Team, 10 more seconds here, 10 more seconds here, then we load the weight on the left side, on even squat, in five. Nice, four, three, two, you're out. I'm gonna load up with my lighter weight, left side, rack 
back in. Head back in, squat it out. In three, two, let's squat, squat. I almost didn't give the 10 second break in between moves. You're ready to move. I was ready to move today. I'm on a comeback from this knee and I'm just ready to go, guys. You just wait. It's gonna be super tough. No, I'm just kidding. It already is. I've mean, had okay. some really tough workouts ever since you got injured. I always say this with your postpartum workouts too. I feel like you always come back stronger than ever and workouts somehow get harder and harder. I like it, Rachel. <laughs> That's why Rachel's here. She is our pump up three, two, one. If you could just tell every mom you come back stronger, she is our pump up team. <laughs> Love it, Rachel. Okay, guys, you're going one minute alternating cleans. And then we get a one minute break between circuits, yes? Let's go. Clean it out. Grab the weight with whatever hand you want to. We're cleaning. In three, two, let's go. Open in your hand. Get it up to the shoulder. It is 60 seconds of cleans. 60 seconds of cleans. Nice work. I've been trying to test my endurance a little bit more by doing like showing some strength circuits and then these one minutes if you haven't seen. I've been building a lot of one minute rounds into our workouts lately because it's a chance to use strength training to raise your heart rate and test your endurance. Woo, I can't run right now, I can't do cardio, I can't do jumping. This is a great alternative team. Halfway, 30 seconds down, 30 to go. Come on, come on. Yes, pick up that heavy weight here. Get after it. That water break and that rest is on the other side. As is upper body, legs get a break. We go arms. In 10 seconds, guys, 10 seconds. Finish strong. Right here, you're in it. For five, four, three, two, one more, because we can. Yes, Rachel. There we go. Woo, grab some water, guys. Weights are down, that's circuit one legs. How do we feel? How do we feel? It's midnight in Australia, my goodness. Yes, you're gonna do this in the morning. Get your sleep. Get that sleep tracker on, get your sleep. Woo. Oh, you're at work, Jamie, but you're gonna do this later. I love it. Nice. Oh, we're better than any program you've ever paid for. Jamie, straight to the heart. Straight to the heart. We love working out with you guys. Our goal is always to make workouts free and accessible to everybody. We're so glad you're here. Circuit two, arms. Okay, chest and back, chest and back. Push-ups, 2023 is the year of the push-up. Right, just gonna get 40 consecutive. She's just gonna crush it. I'm almost halfway there, we're working on it. Yes, she is, we tested it out. Yeah, we tested it. 23. 23. That's my math. We only gotta get another like 17. Is that my math? 17. No, big. No, big. Okay. Okay, let's start with the weight. Actually, let's do right hand first. Right hand for the first second. Okay, this is totally optional. I'm gonna place my hand on the kettlebell. We're just gonna place it on the weight. You don't have to. You can just give me a standard push up. It's an uneven push up into a plank trap. So it looks like this. One push up. Just the right forearm comes around. Pop back up. So it's almost like you're doing a push up and a half each time. Really cool. I know. For 30 seconds. From there, you're rolling right over to your backside. Take your kettlebell or your dumbbell. Option find a hollow rock. Option be on the ground. Chest press for 30 seconds, okay? Push up in a chest press, and then I'll tell you your one minute move. When you get there, it's gonna be super fun. Yes? You ready, Rach? Let's go. Here we go. Right arm only goes into a push up, and then right arm drops into a half plank drop. We go in three, two, one. Let's go. One push up, one half plank drop. Your option is always to take this from the knees. Your option is always to give me an incline push up. It's 30 seconds. Yes, you can. 30 seconds, team. Come on. You got this. Stay with us. Down, up, down, up. It's like a push up and a half. 10 more seconds in the push up, and you're on your backside for hollow rock. Yes, chest press in five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! That's challenging. On your back, I'm going to take my one way. Rachel's got her one way. I'm going to find hollow rock. Legs are going to kick out. Rachel's going to keep her feet on the ground. Chest press. Three, two, let's go. Push. 30 seconds. Chest press right here. Option to engage the core. Option to take it up and put your feet on the ground. So if you want to go heavier on the chest today, you're here. So if you want a little bit more core engagement, you're here. Woo! Hello, chest. One way to get stronger. Holy oh, shit, we're push up so we didn't do this. Huh. It's so tough. That's one minute consecutive on the chest. Huh. Three, two, one. Ah. One minute move. Ooh, you get a cop to a standing position. You're doing five single arm rows on the right arm. Go for five. 
Curl for five. Row for five left. Okay? Five rows, five curls, five rows. We in? Let's go. One minute of work starts in three, two, let's go five rows. Five, four, three, two, one. Now I'm gonna curl. Curl for five, four, three, two, one. Single arm row, other side. Here we go. Row for five. Your pace, your tempo. Five, five, five. Give two more. Two. Back into curls. Let's two. go. Curl it. Five, four, come on. Three, back to single arm rolls, other side. Two, we're halfway. Can we get through another full set? Let's go, yes we can. Five, four, three, two, curl. Curl for five, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Five rows and five curls, let's finish it. Five, four, three, two, one, five more curls and you're out of here. Go, five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Yeah, Rach, crushed it. Love it. Nice work. Let's repeat it, guys. Back to the top. Option, uneven push-up on the left. So I'm gonna put my kettlebell on the left hand, left hand on it, half plank drop on the left. 30 seconds, push-up, half plank drop. 30 seconds, chest press, back to the bicep curls and the rows. You like it? Let's go, I like Five it. Five combos, I'm in. I'm in, 30 seconds. Push up, half plank drop. You're there. In three, stretch it out. In two, come on. Here we go, come on, let's go. Now come out, push up. Half plank drop. Push up. We always like to know too. We mix in some new moves in these live workouts. This is our chance to test stuff with you guys. If you wanna see this move brought back, give us a comment, let us know. Favorite move from today and format. Ah! Yes! Woo! You! Ken, no. 10 seconds, team. Why does it feel so hard? Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Felt hard today. Felt it hard is hard. Today. That's probably why. <laughs> Thursday. Woo! Here we go. Chest press. All the rock or legs to the ground. Three, two, let's go. 30 seconds. Chest press. Down up. Yeah, I like to get some arms in a kettlebell workout. I yeah. guess normally you just think of legs, like swings and things, but this is a good way to fix it up. Right? Always can find a way to make everything full body using just what you have, whether it's a single dumbbell or a kettlebell. Woo! You're in it. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, hold the bananas. My chest is just pooped from that push workout this week. Chest, shoulders, triceps. Okay, good thing we're on back and thighs. Five rows, five rows, five curls. Five rows, five curls. Let's start on the left arm this time. Start on your left arm, it's 60 seconds of work. And it starts in three, two, let's go, let's go, go for five, four, three, two, one. Now let's curl, curl for five, four, Three, yes, two, one, five rows, other arm, come on, five, four, three, two, one. You know what we're doing? Chest and back and biceps in circuit one. That means in circuit four. One more. Switch it up. Yeah. That means in circuit four we got shoulders. But I mean, admittedly, you're just gonna say shoulders are my least favorite upper body. We were right? just talking about that. I never knew that about you. You do a lot of shoulders. We do a ton of shoulders. Eight shoulders. shoulders. <laughs> ah! Ah! Three, two, one. Okay, I've got to get five rows and five curls. Let's go. Five, four, three, two. Finish five curls, and you're out of the circuit. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! See? The kettlebell. It's 30 pounds. I probably would have chosen a 20 if I was using a dumbbell, but the kettlebell forces me to go heavier. Something about that one weight mentality. I like to mix it up. Here we go. How we doing? Two circuits down. Anna says, oh, please like the video. It helps the girls. Anna, cheer squad. You are on Team NML. Welcome. We're going to send you a t-shirt. I'm just kidding. We don't have merch yet. Not everyone's going to comment. Where's the NML t-shirt? I know. Maybe in the future. We, we're just, we are a small but mighty team. We don't have the bandwidth. 
All right, you guys, back to legs. Back to legs, okay? This is a fun circuit. I'm real pumped about it. I'm real pumped about it, okay? It is a staggered stance, rotational, rotational. You can always take this to single leg. I'm gonna go staggered just so I can go heavier. Staggered stance, rotational RDL, so deadlift. So I'm gonna take my kettlebell to the outside of my right foot and up. So I'm holding my left hand outside the right foot and up. So adding some rotation in there, it's gonna increase hip mobility, increase core engagement. You're gonna go right from that into a B stance. So I gotta go a little bit wider, but I'm still keeping this staggered stance. Swing, hinge, swing, hinge, swing for 30 seconds. Hello, one. <laughs> Rotational deadlift into a staggered stance swing. If you don't like this staggered stance, 80 here, 20 here, you can always go bilateral, two feet parallel. You choose staggered stance, dumbbell or kettlebell in your left hand, right foot forward, left toe pop, weight goes to the outside of the right foot for 30 seconds in three, two, let's go. Hinge, 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 stand tall. So I'm taking it outside, rotation, trying to work on a little bit more range of motion here. Nice. Driving through, I have a soft bend in my right leg. I'm crushing an orange in my left armpit to keep that weight tight, tight to the body. Range of motion might look different for everybody here. 10 seconds. You go right from this into that B stance swing, yes? Nice, five, four, three, two, and one. You really wanna challenge, take that single leg. Now I have to go a little bit wider to get this kettlebell between my hands, my grip strength is gonna wear out. You are swinging, swinging in three, two, let's go. Hinge, swing, hinge, swing, come on. B stance, that means this right leg is doing 80% of the work. Right leg is doing 80% of the work, yes? Woo, let's go team. Hello, power, hello, hips, glutes, hamstrings, yes? Make them work for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Set it down. Woo! Nice work, team. Your one minute move is a standard deadlift. So I'm going to take the weight, place it towards my heels. If you have a kettlebell, you can go a little bit more midline, Rachel. I'm going to reach back for this weight. Deadlift. I'm going to try to tap this weight between my heels so I get that nice hip hinge. Yes? Okay? Do the standard deadlift for 30 seconds and do standard swings for 30 seconds. Yes? Option is always to stick with the deadlift. You get to decide. Deadlift in three, two, let's go. Hinge, grab the weight, stand up. Nice, set it down. Oh, what am I doing? This is not an alternate. You're keeping the weight the whole time. You're just tapping the weight down. This is slow and steady. If you have a kettlebell right here, my number one cue is thinking about breaking this horn in half. The minute you try to break this horn in half, like shh, your, you feel your lats? Shh, my lats just activated. Try to break the horn in half. That's the same cue as crushing the oranges in the armpits. It is going to activate the lats, which keep that weight tight to the body. Swing time. Oh, swing! Hey, yeah, swing it out. 30 seconds. 30 seconds of swings. Power. Strength and power. We love to pair them. Woo! Let's go. Come on. Swing it, swing it. Right here. What would it look like if I said 10 more seconds of swings? 10 more seconds of swings. Let's go, team. You're in it for five, four, three, two, one. Nice. That weight lands in front of me. Woo! Release it. Quick sip of water. Right back in. B stance. Rotational deadlift on the left. B stance swing on the left. Deadlifts and swings. I like it, right? I like it. Woo! 80% in this left foot, right toe popped. Weight is gonna go in my right hand. Weight is gonna go outside, left toe. Yes, that's where we go. In three, two, let's go. Rotate, nice. What do you think of rotational deadlift? I like it, it's different. I always like mixing it up, you know? Right? Always good to mix it up, team. Keeps coming back for more. My prayer is that these workouts always bless and encourage you that you'll be feeling encouraged. Whether this move felt good for you today or not, it doesn't matter, make it work for you. Go to a standard one. I want you to be feeling encouraged that you were able to accomplish what your body let you today. Come on, four, three, two, one more, rest for 10. I gotta set it down because my grip is so big. Here we go, I'm gonna take a little bit wider stance and I'm gonna swing in. 80% here, make your left leg work. In three, two, let's go, let's go, hinge, swing. 30 
seconds. 30 seconds of swings from this staggered stance. Puts a little bit more pressure on this working leg. It's only 30 seconds. You can do anything for 30 seconds. Yes, Rach? That grip work is no joke, too. Right? I've been working on pull-ups. Hey! Oh my gosh, my grip. Grip strength if you're working on those pull-ups right here. Let's go, team five. Four, three, two, one. Set it down. Holy bananas, that's 30 pound weight. Woo! All right, 30 seconds of deadlift. 30 seconds of standard swings. Closing out legs. Oh. Closing out legs. Deadlifts in three, two. Let's go, 30 seconds of deadlift. Soft bend in the knees. Initiate with a hip hinge. Break the horns of that kettlebell in half. Come on, come on. Nice. Hinge. You got it. Working those hammies, back of the legs. You're gonna go right into hammies and glutes and hips with swings in 10 seconds, team. Swing it out in 10 seconds. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Let's swing, hinge, drive, drive. Yes, 30 seconds of power right here. Come on. Nice. Work. Yes, Rachel. Crushing it. I love swings. I think they're so fun. They're a big, powerful move. They make you feel strong. Yes, what would I look like if I said 10 more seconds? 10 more seconds. What do you got for me today? Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Set it down. Grab some water. You guys are awesome. Three circuits down, one to go. Where's our boat at? Where's our vote at? What do we got here? 58% says the down dog kettlebell drag. All right. 42% burpees. Team Rachel. Everybody's team Rachel today. Team Rachel. I like it, you guys. Nice work, Judy. Love that you can feel your core. Core is totally turned on entire time. You're sweating so much, Alyssa. Keep it up. All right, guys. Last thing is arms, okay? If you follow us on Instagram, you might have seen me do this at the gym the other day. We're going to bring it into a kettlebell workout. I'm debating. Can I do 25? I don't know. We're going to try. Let's go. Okay. Here's a squat curl press. Okay. Squat. I'm going to give you a baby squat curl press. You're going to do that for 30 seconds. Then we're going to go into 30 seconds. I'm going to drop my weight and show you a bottoms up press. If you're with me, that's harder. That means the bottom of your kettlebell faces the ceiling. Causes a lot more mobility and stability for the shoulders. Okay. So, squat curl press into bottoms up press. Yes? Woo! You ready, Rach? Let's go. Last circuit. Last circuit, team. Last circuit. Squat curl press in three, two. Let's go. Give me the squat, the curl, the push. The squat, the curl, the push. 30 seconds squat curl press. Your pace, your tempo. Come on. Nice work. It's upper body right here. Your one minute move is a core move. Lucky you. Yes? Come on, team. Nice work. 10 more seconds on the squat curl press. 10 more seconds here. Nice work. Five, four, three, two. I'm gonna switch up to my lighter weight. I'm gonna go bottoms up. Grab each horn, bottom of the dumbbell faces up. You're giving me a press, a shoulder press. In three, two, one. I'm just resting my cheeks on the kettlebell. I'm so hot, this feels good. The kettlebell's cold metal. 30 seconds, bottoms up press. So we're the talking stuff. <laughs> Just focus the squinty eye, uh, the heavy breathing. Get in the zone. It's hard. It's tough. You were made for this. You were made for hard things. Yes, you were. Come on, say yes, I can. For five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! All the bananas down to the ground. No weight or take away with you. Okay? Seated twist if you're with Rachel. If you're with me, twist, twist, reverse crunch. Looks like this twist. Twist, reverse crunch with a pullover up. Okay? Twist, twist, reverse crunch. Option add to pull over or dump. You're doing it for one minute. We go on three, two, let's go, let's go. Twist, twist. This is slow and controlled, guys. See the twists are not how fast they're going to go. It is slow controlled. Option, feet on the mat. Option, feet float. You decide what's going to work for you today. Nice work. You're extending that kettlebell overhead. Oh, that's mighty tough, right? Shh. Come on, come on. Use your breath to get that kettlebell back. Big old limbs. 
Halfway team. 30 seconds down, 30 to go. So end of the workout. I can feel my body fatiguing, that is for sure. Nice work, team. Yes, you're in it right here. Come on, 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Stay with us. Five, four, three, two. You're out. Woo! Woo! Hold it out. Grab some water. Like, what is my heart rate at? I'm just like dying over here. Core, but make it curvy, you know. Woo! All right, squat curl press, bottoms up press. One more set on the twist. That's it, guys. Circuit four, finish it, and then the one minute burnout. Yes? Let's go. Oh, well, that's it. Okay, come on, get your mind right. Get your mind right. Here we go. Let's go. 30 seconds, squat curl press. In three, two, let's go. Squat, curl, press. Who's got a second cup of coffee coming after this? I do. to look forward to, right? I was telling the team when they got here, it was one of those nights. Brooks, my nine-month-old, is teething. We're at 2 a.m. My husband and I were having that argument where I'm like, he's like, I'm like, your turn. He's like, I was just in there five minutes ago. I'm like, no, I was just in there for 30 minutes. He's like, no, I was in there. I'm like, no, I was in there. <laughs> ah, five, four, three, two, one. Bottoms up, press. I'm gonna take my 10 second break. Take your rest, take your rest. Here we go, press it, overhead press. In three, two, one. I owe my husband a big thanks though. He did the early morning shift. He got up at 5.30. So I could get that extra 30 minutes of sleep. All the nursing moms out there say, hey, <laughs> you did it for the first time in a month. So like, ah, ah, it burns, it burns. Five, four, three, Two, one, holy banana boat. Woo! Here we go, core, core. Sit on your backside. Twist, twist. Kick it out if you want to, reverse crunch. One minute, one minute. And then we're in the bonus round, right? Let's yeah. Go. Let's, let's do it. it. This is truly a 35 minute workout, it turns out. Okay, here we go, three, two, let's go. Twist, twist, reach it. Big pull over, twist, twist, come on. Nice work, twist. Twist. One minute of work, guys. One minute of work. Yes, you can. Get your mind right, right here. You are in to win it. Yes? Big Thursday. Maybe it's a big Friday. Maybe it's a big Saturday. Whatever day you do this workout. This is going to make you stronger and better. Fill your cup right here so you can love on and serve those around you. 30 down, 30 to go. Woo! Woo! Yes, team. So strong, that's where we are, right here. Stay with me, you got this. Whoa! Let's go, come on, Lindsay. That's hard. Come on, 10 seconds. 10 seconds, team. Come on, push. Five, four, three, two, and one. Pull the banana boat. That's your workout. But we promised we'd let you pick a burnout move. Everybody votes 60% is on team down dog, kettlebell drag. So that's what we do. Let's do it. All right. Do it with the weight or do it with no weight at all. You can either side. I'm gonna use my lightest weight. Bring it up to your right hand, okay? Right hand is gonna drag. So you're gonna start on high plank. Right hand drags to left toe, come into high plank. Pick the weight up, bring it back, set it down. You're just dragging right here on this cross panel. Went to cross panel. Yeah. I don't know, across your midline. <laughs> across your midline for 30 seconds. On the right side, and then we're gonna go left side. It's one minute of work. Yeah? Oh, let's finish it. Right this is it, guys. This is it. One minute. And it starts. Ready, Rach? Let's go. Right hand drags to left toe. In three, find your plank. In two, and one. Grab the weight, down dog to the left toe. High plank. Reach back, find it. Bring it back to high plank. Set it down. Take it back. This is all your face, your tempo. Slow and steady, guys. It is 30 seconds. It's a good way. I'm glad I got this move. It's a good way to add it's new, too. It's like strength and mobility paired together, right? 30 seconds per side. Nice work. And it's a new move. Let us know. We love to hear what you think of our new move. You're switching sides in three, two, bring the weight across, switch out. Left hand goes to right toe. High plank. Go get it. Bring it back. Nice work. Come on, finish strong right here.
your team. BCM burpees will have to bring back in another workout. The BCM burpees will come back another time, guys. Nice work. Stay with me. You got it. You're in it. The final five seconds, guys. Hello, four today. Hello, four. Five, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead, just drop to your knees right here. High five yourself. Go. High five your partner. You guys crush today's live workout. We are going to stretch it out. If you have to pop off, thanks for joining us. We love you. Thanks for joining us on Instagram. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for joining us on YouTube. These were fire. Live workouts are so much fun, aren't they, Alice? I just love them. And you'd love, oh, you're excited about the opportunity of a potential monthly membership. Let me tell you, if you want more live workouts, make sure you hit subscribe to our YouTube channel. We got big plans for 2023, and we are so excited to share them with you guys, okay? Nice work. Your daughter Lily says hi to Rachel. Rachel, give Lily a shout out. Hi, Lily. I love these kids. I feel like the kids normally work out with Rachel. I love that. She's five and uses two pound weights, and Rachel is her big bud. Yes, we love it. Hi, Lily. The cutest. Nice work, Laura. Nice work, Lori. Nicole, you guys are so awesome. Let's stretch it out, team. Whoa, we got a super chat. I see came in. Megan, read it to us. Yeah, Nicole says, thanks for helping this former dancer become a strength warrior after three pregnancies. Woo! Nicole? Keep up the awesome work, Nicole. Yeah. Nicole! Awesome. Three babies later, feeling the strongest ever. We love you, Nicole. We're so glad you love it, too. Find a nice quad cut position right here. Thanks for supporting us, Nicole. We always appreciate it. Drop the belly, lift the chin, and reverse it. Find both up towards the chin. Let's do it again. Drop the belly, lift the chin. Nice. And reverse it. Hello, shoulders. We're going to give them a little bit of love it right here. Big reach up and thread the needle. Right here, mat, right shoulder to mat. Nice. Just threading the needle, pushing into that shoulder. Hips are staying high. So proud of you guys. That was a tough workout. And no jumping. Totally felt the heart rate. Right? Woo! Who's on team yoga jump? I am. Lock them up. Thread the needle. Tell this knee is healed. Then I'm back with jumps, you guys. Nice work. Just take a deep breath here. Big exhale. Awesome work. Bring it up back to that quadruped position. You're going to tuck the toes under. You're going to put yourself up and back to a down dog. You're going to cuddle through those heels. Big inhale up to the toes. Exhale, melt the calves down to the ground. You're just going to stretch here in this down dog position. Think about pushing your chest towards your thighs. Really think about lengthening through those hamstrings, which got a lot of love today. Walk back. Hands to the toes. Find a nice forward fold here. Right hand to the mat. Left arm opens up. Gaze follows fingertips. Switch it out. Left arm down, right arm up. Nice work. Again, you're just going to find that forward fold, stretching through those hamstrings, which got a ton, a ton, a ton of love in today. All the way up. Nice work. Once you get to the top, two big shoulder rolls up, back and down. Up, back and down. Hips got a lot of love in too. So you're going to step back and you're going to find an isometric lunge hold option to drop all the way down, okay? Just hold it here. Think about tucking your tailbone to me because your hips got a lot of action in those slings, right? So you're going to lengthen through this. Couch stretch is the number one stretch I'm working on right now. If you're following me on Instagram, you saw me doing it yesterday morning. Lengthening and opening up these hips, lengthening through the quad. Nice. From here, plant the hands, and we're going to go back into the hamstring, but you're going to stretch this front right hamstring. Pyramid pose. So it's that standard stance again, right foot forward, left toe back. Head lights, your hips to square to me. Think about lengthening through this front right hammy. Nice work. Step to meet each other. Switch it out. Right knee goes down or to the mat. Come up. Lengthening right here through this hip. Talking that tailbone to me. Nice. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. For three, two, one. Hands frame that front left foot. Step up, shorten your stance. Pyramid pose. Keep the hips square to us. Think about lengthening through this front left hamstring right there. Nice work. Set the feet up to meet each other. Bend knees. Roll all the way up to the top when you get there. Two big shoulder rolls up, back and down. Up, back and down. High five, Rach. Good job. You crushed it. High five, Team NML. If you have questions or comments, we always love to stick around and chat with you guys. You can drop them in the chat. Thanks so much for joining us on Instagram. Such a fun workout. Make sure if you're not already, subscribe to that YouTube channel and join our email newsletter list so you get our new two-week workout challenge for February. Two weeks of workouts dropping at you every single day. We give you your workout of the day. Split training specific muscle groups to help you feel stronger. Yes? Thanks so much, Instagram. I'm going to kick off here, and we're going to keep this workout live so you can come back and do it. Have a great day. Thanks so much for joining us, Hannah. Awesome job. Thank you, guys.
Awesome job. How are we feeling? You guys crushed it. Holy glute burn. The single leg swing, right? It's harder. I love that B stance swing. It's just something a little bit different. You've always passed on kettlebell workouts, but you're so glad you did this one, Stephanie. We are two. It was a good one, right? Way to try something new. We as adults often don't step out of our comfort zone, so you are stinking awesome. So much love from you guys. So glad you like this workout. Nice work. You love the burnout move at the end. You'd love to see more yoga bar sculpt. Okay. More yoga bar bar and sculpt. We take that feedback seriously, guys. So thanks so much for sharing your feedback. Oh, thank you, Chad's Turtle Dove. Chad's Turtle Dove. That's your username, Chad's Turtle Dove. I want to say, did I say that right? Chad's Turtle Dove. You loved it. Thanks so much, ladies. Thanks so much for the super chat and your support. We're so grateful. Just so you guys know, like these super chats and these um, super thanks. This this is going towards helping our making making our channel better. We'd love to come at you more with live workouts and make our live workouts a little bit more studio quality professional. Maybe in the future we can add music and timers and those things. We just don't have those capabilities right now. So that's where this these funds go. So thank you so much for all your support. Emily, Emily Richter from Team Fit Foodie Finds. Thanks so much for the workout. Thanks for joining us, Em. So grateful for you. Awesome job. Aven, you love seeing the new moves. Kettlebell push-up with the arm drop was fun. I like that one too. I think we should definitely bring it back. Jennifer, Jennifer Bartlink with a super chat. Thanks so much. We appreciate the love and the support. You are so stinking awesome. You guys are the best. Thanks so much for the love. We always love getting to work out with you guys. It is so fun. And we like the polls. I think it makes it fun. Do you guys like the polls? Do you like choosing the moves? I would not know the moves coming. I feel like that's good. <laughs> I, I read the whole workout and I'm like, this is how I wanted it to go. But you guys just threw a curveball at me. Now I'm glad. I really liked ending with that move too. It was really fun. More professionals, always great. Thanks so much for your effort. Thanks, Sarah. Thanks for following us along. We always appreciate it, you guys. That arm drop was a surprise burner, right? I agree. You'd love to see a two week, 20 minute functional strength kettlebell workouts because you're still loving the first New Year's challenge. You wish there was a kettlebell version. That 20 minutes strong in 20. We love it, you guys. So 20 minutes, give a, we get like so much feedback. It's like 20 minutes, 30 minutes, some people want longer. The 20 minutes was a really fun challenge and we would love to do something again like it. So thank you so much. You loved the poll, such a good workout. You guys are so awesome. We always love sweating with you. We're gonna sign off and it was so great chatting with you and we hope to see you guys again soon. We have a live workout coming at you on February 14th, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day, suit up in your pink outfits and join us for a super spicy Valentine's Day full body sweat. Everyone wear pink. Team NML, lace up in your pink. We're coming at you on 214 February day, February day, February, Valentine's Day with a fun full body sweat session. So grab your pink and join us. Nice work. We'll have a poll with burpees being both of the move options. Okay, maybe for February, maybe for Valentine's Day. We'll see. Have a great day, you guys.